And the National Assembly's Public Investments Committee has given the management of Kenya Medical Supplies Authority an ultimatum of seven days to furnish it with detailed statements of the payment criteria for farms awarded in the multi-million shillings a COVID-19 tender. According to the committee, there are inconsistencies in the payment modalities that points to favoritism. The National Assembly's Public Investment Committee has questioned the inconsistency reported in the payment of firms that supplied personal protective equipment to Kenya Medical Supplies Authority. Of concern to the committee was how some companies had their payments hastened. This is the question I'm asking. Were you under any duress at any given time? Were there any preference of some? Of, of course, in your second point, you mentioned clearly that people with Agbo were paying within 30 days. Were there other people that you are paying faster than others? And uh, of course you are under oath and you must be able to tell us the truth about it. These were tenders that, uh, for instance, Likol needed to uh, ensure due diligence. If you look at the contract, for instance, we were insisting that warehouses, warehousing manager confirm that the goods indeed have arrived. And uh, in the numbers... You just contradicted yourself. Uh, don't tell us about due diligence, because there was none. After listening to the witnesses that we have, and we have lit listened to more than 50 or so witnesses, mm -hmm. some of us are persuaded to think that you withheld payments for people whom you didn't have interests in, and paid people that you associated with or that you wanted kickbacks on. That's the point. Yeah. But the management of KEMSA comprised of acting CEO Edward Njoroge, legal officer Frederick Wanyonyi, chief financing officer Waiganjo Karanja, and acting director of procurement failed to explain the inconsistencies in price and negotiation regime, with the chief financing officer claiming some payments bypassed his office. I think the, pay the payment was ideally done on the basis of the final negotiated price. But would you call it a negotiation when everyone is paid the, almost the same? It doesn't look that it is a usual thing or that are you in agreement that these are prices that had been pre-planned? I wouldn't say so, but uh, it's, uh, it's odd. Some of, the, some of the payments were done between the chairman, the CEO, and the next signatory, the other signatory, and some are between the CEO and myself. Wait a minute. Are, you, are you trying to tell me, wait, wait, wait. Are you trying to tell me that there are payments that would bypass your department? Yes, Chairman. There, there are payments that would bypass the finance department. The management also noted that quality assurance of the items was done after goods were supplied, as the committee expressed its doubts on the urgency of the supplies. Roughly 20% of the items have so far been sold. The KEMSA management was given seven days to prepare a conclusive report after the committee found its response wanting. Kamche Menza for Channel 1 News.